Renewable hemp steel makes hydraulic fracturing look like mad science. Think about it. Instead of harvesting superior biodegradable energy from hemp, hydraulic fracturing has countless gallons of toxic chemicals and water pumped into shale to extract gases, doing so much damage to the environment and poisoning people. Gas can be derived from hemp that is biodegradable and good for the earth, harvesting more gas compared to other sources. There's a lot of wasteland good for growing hemp that can help detoxify and regenerate the soil. Maybe people wouldn't be protesting against hydraulic fracturing and contaminated water if hemp fuel was cheap and abundant. Hydraulic fracturing might have not ever developed if hemp fuel was abundant and not a suppressed energy source. Hemp fuel is a superior energy source that doesn't get media attention compared to toxic energy sources renewable hemp fuel can make obsolete. The more abundant hemp fuel becomes, the cheaper transportation will get that makes the cost of living cheaper. The price to produce things would get cheaper, which means more business and a stronger economy where people won't live in fear of collapse. The economy would be stronger if people were able to grow their own superior hemp food and save money. Americans have no idea the University of Connecticut have a study the hemp biodiesel showed a high efficiency of conversion. 97% of the hemp oil was converted to biodiesel. So people could make their homes energy independent without having to pay bills and grow biodegradable fuel for transportation.